tool that Tassem, the director, needed was that he wanted to place the horizon line on the virtual shooting on the set. And it was very important to him to understand where in this virtual world he was moving around. He had some mountains, he had some water, and it was very important for him that the actors and everybody on, on set understood what world this was in. We was running around doing all kinds of different setups. Cranes, dollies, pan and tilt on high lifts, looking up, looking down in dust and smoke and with uh, hundreds and hundreds of people running around it. For example, we were on top of a mountain looking down on all this human world underneath. And, and especially for that, it was very useful to have the virtuals on the cranes, since we did a lot of 30-foot and 50-foot techno moves. It was so easy to explain that now they should look down and not looking out to the horizon. Such a thing as eyeline is super important when you do uh, virtual stuff, when, when people have to look at the virtuals. If they look on the sky instead of looking at the ground, it, it looks wrong. And then since Tassem is such a perfectionist, he needed the virtuals. Doing stuff like this requires a really good, simple to use, stable system that is versatile enough to, to run around on a film shoot. We have more and more clients that want to have previous on set because now it's possible, and that's because of the chameleon of course, it's possible to bring on simple shoots and, and difficult shoots. You can just take a frame grab from Chameleon where the director and the DP agrees on the, the framing and then this was how the intention was and this was how everybody thought it looked good. I haven't done Chameleon work uh, like this before but I found out that hey this system is, uh, is really great. It worked from day one to the end.